Hi everyone, we're going to do this related uh, rates problem. We have two boats A and B, they leave at the same place at the same time. Boat A heads due north at 12 kilometers per hour. Boat B heads due east at 18 kilometers per hour. After 2.5 hours, how fast is the distance between the boats increasing in kilometers per hour? So basically what we have, we have two boats moving at right angles to each other. So let's say they start at the origin here, and they're forming a right triangle. So the distance between them is the hypotenuse. So whenever we see right triangles and related rate problems, we're looking for the uh, to use the Pythagorean theorem. So we're going to call the distance that boat A travels um, y because that's going north and we'll call the distance that boat B travels x. Um, and we're looking to see uh, how fast z is growing and how fast the z is growing is going to be um, dz with respect to time the fast the the rate at which boat a goes is dy with respect to time and how fast uh, the rate at which b is going is dx with respect to time so let's uh, write up the pythagorean theorem we have x squared plus y squared equals z squared. Now we're going to differentiate both sides. So if I differentiate x squared, I get 2x, and that's dx with respect to time. And then we get 2y, which is dy with respect to time. And for the z, I get 2z dz d time. <laughs> derivative of z with respect to time. Okay, and also, um, since they all have 2's in them, I can divide everything by 2 and uh, just simplify this. So this would be x dx over dt plus y, derivative of y with respect to t, and z dz over dt. All right, now, after 2.5 hours, uh, boat A has traveled 30 miles, uh, 30 kilometers, because we have, um, remember boat, A, let's see, which one are we talking about? Boat A is, um, let's see, where's boat A? Due north at 12. So we do 12 times 2.5, and that's going to give you 30. So that equals your y. And then for b, what do we have for b? We had 18 times 2.5. And that's going to equal uh, 45. And that's your x. So um, plugging in for your um, x, we know that we're going to get x squared plus y squared equals z squared. And what we're going to get with that is 30 squared plus uh, 45 squared equals z squared. And that's going to end up being z is going to be z squared equals uh, 2925 square root so Z is going to be approximately 54.08. Now I'm going to go back to this equation and plug everything in. Okay, so basically, if we plug everything in, I'm going to write it again. We have X dx over dt plus Y dy over dt equals Z dz over dt. And now we're just going to substitute. So my x was 45, and my rate of change is 18. My y is 30, 
but my rate of change was um, with respect to time is 12 and then we have Z is 54.08 and we don't know what DZ um, the rate of change for the, um, Z is so basically uh, when you clean all this up you're going to get this part here it's going to equal 1170 and then divide both sides by 54.08 and you're going to get 21.63 equals your rate of change with respect to time from the um, the distance between the two uh, boats. Thank you. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. <laughs>